so let's take a look at how you can create library book checkout tracker in Airtable. So what you can do is start from scratch. Here you can choose to use existing Google Sheet or Excel data or even paste data or get CSV data here. Now the default one looks something like this when you start the base but we will get rid of those fields right so here we already have few rows of data we will simply edit the field okay change the name to number right and add it to auto number save this now first column that we will add is student name okay considering they won't be part of user or fair table we want them to manually add single line of text with their name then we want to add email field right. so let's use email field then we have phone right so phone field is also there so phone number right so it will use the typical us based number so if you are in any other region you will have to use the single line text or even use number right so do that okay once we have these things taken care of we will have to come to book so our book is single line text create field right then we have book borrow date which is going to be a date borrow date right? so we will use date friendly including time then 24 hour create field then we have our one more date which is due date right right then we have it here in date like friendly date include time 24 hour create field now let's go and add one more thing which is going to be days or if you have any other note right okay, so we will go with note right so this is pretty much the thing can show you the example let's say Adam took the book his email is Adam at some company then his phone is something like these right so in some state it could be different so you will have to go through that then he is choosing Christmas Carol book borrowed on let's say 26 due date is let's say next week 6 right then we have notes right so we will add them as content comes in right so let's see if I want to turn a form for this sort of process so what I can do is simply go to views, go to form, then we will choose personal for now, then library book tracker is the name. So I will simply copy this and create view. Also I will add same name to my base, use icon, that's it. Now here type in insert new book borrow entry right and then simply open new form right so here we see the form here that shows new student name say gen at usc.net then Right. then book it something like laws of power 
then borrow date 27 due date january 7 okay no notes right and submit you can also make some of the uh, things required fields right then we will go to view and then check the grid view right then we will come back here and see that we have our entry added to the base right so considering you can remove this it will expand into this view which is full screen right so here you can see all the fields there you can add notes you can also highlight some of the options here and if you have limited people you can also add them as a user in student name field right so this is a library book checkout tracker in your table